it's a big weekend. It's arguably the, the biggest weekend of my career so far. It's always very exciting. I hope they're going to go like, wow, what a car. More and more Formula 2 is integrated yeah, yeah, yeah. to the Formula 1 world. And uh, that's something that we really, really appreciate. And it's so important for Formula 2 because at the end of the day, we're there to prepare drivers for Formula 1. I know for sure. Always a lot of interest, not just from the current F2 drivers, current F1 team bosses who want to see what is going to be training in their future stars, but also from the F3 drivers, you know, who are hopefully going to be driving yeah, this yeah. thing next year. Yeah, yeah. Interesting. Interesting is my what I would call it. No, I mean, it looks good. Looks cool, looks nice. Ah, it's pretty cool. It's fast, it's okay. Man. It's a new and exciting generation coming. Bosch, Bosch, Bosch. Buona yes. fortuna. No, it's uh, al bocca al lupo. No. <laughs> Yeah, si, Boca Lupo, no? Uh, yeah. You don't say good luck in it. In Boca Lupo. In Boca Lupo. In the mouth of uh, Wolf. Fighting for a Formula 2 title is, is a dream, I think, for any young driver who wants to approach Formula 1. It's time to, to set up the showdown and, and go for it. It's uh, very exciting. It's so cool to, to be in this battle. I know Fred from last year, he was, he was my teammate. and. It's always uh, clean on the track and respectful with him. But uh, you know, now we, we are fighting for a championship. It's a lot of hard work. And of course, I would lie if I said I'm not disappointed that I'm not in lead because I've been for the most of the season. But um, yeah, I'm ready to fight and I'm ready to, to give everything we have. Monza especially, there is a lot of overtaking opportunities and uh, it's always crazy there, the races. So hopefully we can have a great fight and uh, of course, I can extend my, my lead if possible. Yeah. How is the track condition, Rory? I haven't been out there yet. <laughs> I don't know. Can you let me know afterwards? Yeah, I will let you know. Um, but yeah, looking and forward to it. <laughs> <laughs>
Really, really happy to see him on the podium today, and uh, and I'm really happy to see to see Trident doing such a good job. he can relax a little bit and he know he still can do it so yeah we keep on pushing all the feelings you have when you win i can only mention monaco it's like the best day of my life but equally you need to understand that those feelings goes the opposite as well when you have a bad day and when you win everything seems great but when you lose it's just so painful It means a lot to me. Obviously, um, Spa and Sanford was uh, very difficult in a future race. So, to finish on the podium now is uh, important to, to restart um, this uh, championship. Obviously, it's, uh, it's this is the second to last round, but uh, this definitely helps, and I'm just fully motivated now for tomorrow. Good morning. <laughs> How are you? Ah, great, great, great. Uh, starting P1, so it feels good. We are in the middle of a championship battle that is heading to the wire. It is an incredible place to go motor racing for our penultimate feature race of the year. And it's wheel to wheel through Curva Grande. And Oliver Behrman takes the lead into the Rosier. Vesti spinning, Vesti into the wall. And the driver who's second in the championship was squeezed by Stanek. And that is a huge moment in the context of the championship. What is he doing? He put me directly into the wall. Good job, mate. Yes, guys. Come on in. What a race. That was hard. We had so much safety car. Oh, my God. We needed that, guys. Good job. Great day. Feels a bit disappointed, but in the end, so the key moment for you I'm was will be going to Abu Dhabi with a bit less stress, I guess. So. Really amazing. Um, one of my best feelings, one of my best wins, um, to do it in front of the home crowd. It's also kind of my home race as well because you know I live out here, and yeah, to see the support from the fans, even for an F2 race, was really amazing. Managed a good start, and uh, I knew I had to take the lead, and uh, probably I could take a bit more risk than tail. Overall, uh, it's a strong weekend. Uh, of course, um, starting from P1 in the future race, I wanted to win, but sometimes you, you cannot. But I'm in control, you know. I'm, I'm in control of, uh, of the championship, and um, I, I'm confident for Abu Dhabi, you know. I'm really confident. Um, we are fast there. But still, the job is not, not done, so I'm uh, still focused. 